Hello, my name is Brian Seaman. I'm the shop foreman with Philip Chevrolet in Frankfort, Illinois, and I'm here with a fine 2012 Chevy Silverado pickup with a 6.6 .6 diesel engine in a 2500 series truck. I'm here today to talk to you a little bit about diesel exhaust fluid. Let me shut this off and I'll get into details a little more for you. What diesel exhaust fluid does it reduces oxides of nitrogen in your exhaust system. That's a pollutant that we used to control with EGR valve and, and what happens there is the, uh, the cylinder temperatures uh, become over 2500 degrees and start uh, creating these uh, oxides of nitrogen that get in the atmosphere and, and mess with the ozone layer. So what we have on this diesel uh, truck system, uh, we have this exhaust fluid that we add to the system to be induced into the exhaust system uh, like a shower head spray to help reduce those uh, pollutants. Uh, in the past we've done this with the EGR valve which we still have on on the diesel truck but the majority of uh, uh, the reduction is done now. When we do a new car PDI we add 5.3 gallons of diesel exhaust fluid to a container where I'm going to show you here in a minute um, to fill this system up and we'll have the message here that uh, reads exhaust fluid level okay. Now from what we figured here about every thousand miles that you drive the vehicle it's going to lose about one gallon from where we started the 5.3 gallons. So let's walk around the truck here I'll show you where you put this in at. You may have noticed a, a plastic tank sitting on the passenger side of the vehicle. This is actually the diesel exhaust fluid tank. Uh, it's actually about 7.2 gallons worth of capacity, but we only put 5.3 gallons in there because uh, the urea that we put into the uh, tank here is made up of 68% water and about 32% urea, which is like an ammonia-based fluid. It will freeze uh, at lower temperatures. Uh, I think 17 degrees is about where they say this thing will start to freeze pretty solid. This is actually a two and a half gallon container of, of the diesel exhaust fluid that we add uh, in the reservoir right here with the blue cap on it. This is where you want to put the fluid. What I've been told that this system, you know, you're, you're probably asking yourself, oh, you know, now I got a, another thing that I got to buy and maintain on, uh, on my vehicle besides changing oil and different fluids on it. From what engineers tell me, uh, the amount of gas mileage that has increased by using this system over the EGR valve system offsets the cost of the fluid uh, because this, this engine does get quite a bit better gas mileage than the older diesels. But there pretty much you have it. That's kind of a, a general rundown of our diesel exhaust fluid system. If you have any questions, please call me, Brian Seaman, the shop foreman at Phillips Chevrolet, 815- 469-2323 with any other questions that you might have about the system. Thanks.